what's up y'all we are jumping into this look so if you want to see how i achieved it just keep watching day and night palette by upscale faces y'all that's how it look i'm using this color right here okay y'all so we're gonna put this color right here Ooh, look at that like how pigmented that is I that. I'm envisioning what I'm doing. Yes, friend. And you know what? The fact that this brush picks up so much. Man. I ain't know you was gonna do me like that. Okay, I think I'm gonna use cinnamon, y'all. Let me on that thing out. Now, we finna go into coffee. So we finna go into this color right here, y'all. This dark brown. And I'm gonna use a pencil brush because I wanna control this color, okay? If you miss like some of my lives, I do post them on YouTube. That's just FYI. All right. I'm gonna blow that out with something. So I'm gonna get another blending brush, another little fluffy brush, y'all. You sent it, thanks, babe. And I'm gonna use cinnamon to blend that out too, cause because I like cinnamon. It's like a, it's like a, a warm brown. It's like a warm brown. I like cinnamon. Blend that thing out. And just deepen that look. So this is the, the coffee that I'm using, y'all. I just wanna make sure that that dark is nice and blended. I use cinnamon because when I'm doing blending, I wanna bring it all the way over, you know what I'm saying? I blended cinnamon out with that toy cord. Cause y'all know my eyelids are fat. So this make them less fat, right? Make it look like they're a little bit deep down now. Just blend it on out. I take the micellar water to clean off the lid. I take a concealer brush and dip it inside the micellar water and clean off my lid, y'all. And then clean that sucker off. All right, I'm using the acid rain base to cut my crease. Still brush set. Take that coffee color and start to close this on out. Close it on out, friend. The services is no longer needed. Close it out. Like you'd be having to see it, friend. Like, okay, I think I see something. I think I see something. So I'm putting the color cream right inside of that there. Now I'm taking the shimmer tour course inside that same palette and I'm going to start taking it towards the inner corner of my eye, complete neck wing. This is the um, Power Grip Primer, y'all. I just ordered three of these. She running low. And I don't order it at time running low. Like, I, I suck at, at stuff like that. 
Look at the thing that's neutralized that foundation. I only want to say you don't say a child. We, 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 we sound like sisters at this point. At this point, we sisters. Not the Capri Sun friend. Friend, it's the, it's the Kool-Aid jam. It's the Kool-Aid jam. Bye-bye. I can't make this up. Hey, Jasmine. On sale, friend. All right, taking my number four brush from Upscale Faces. Brush that, and we about to blend this foundation in and make it skin. All right, so the lash glue done dried on the lashes, so now we finna just put them on. So this is the Urban Decay's um, Concealer Y'all in the shade 40. And I'm going to mix that um, that white concealer. I, I liked it a little bit yesterday. Me. All right, so we, we finna do this LA Pro Girl trick, y'all. So I am putting that white concealer I'm mixing it with my concealer because I ain't got that. Not today. Just a smidget. Just a smidget. Taking a real technique brush and blending it out. Taking the mixed race palette by Planet Makeup by Yolando, I'm gonna be going in with that warm brown first, pretty much warming up the area that I'm gonna contour. Now I'm taking that cooler brown, that darker brown tone, and start contouring my face with that. Using my setting powder by Laura Mercier in the shade Translucent Honey, I'm going to start setting my concealer basically under the eyes, the forehead, bridge of the nose, chin, upper lip. Taking a dual lash glue with the purple writing on it, placing it under my waterline. Now I'm taking a glitter from J. LaRue Cosmetics in the style Starburst, and I'm going to place that directly on top of that dual lash glue. Dusting the remaining powder off of my face and pressing it in. Taking Morphe Satin Spray to set everything and then start to press it in with my foundation brush. This is the bronzer palette I'm using to pretty much warm my face back up. Taking Juvia's loose um, highlight pigment and start to highlight my cheekbones. <laughs> 
This is my pressed powder from um, J. LaRue Cosmetics and the shade Cookie Dough. And I'm going to use this to pretty much set my face. And this powder is used if you see your pores showing or if you see any creases, this will cover it up. So I love this powder. Taking the upscale face palette again and I'm going to go into the shade Donut and Mars and pretty much put that in my tear ducts in the inner corner of my eye, on the tip of my nose, and on the bridge of my nose as well. And I'm also going to add a little bit to my Cupid's bow. This is, you already know, Planet Makeup by Yolando in the shade Lola. This is my favorite brown matte lipstick. I'm going to apply that to my lips. So this is where I pretty much had an epiphany. I'm gonna take this shade and this acid rain base in the shade Sexy Chill and place that in the middle of my lips, y'all. Taking some glitter to add an extra pop to these lips. all right babes we reached the end of this video thank you so much for watching the um eyeshadow palette i used was by upscale faces you can go to upscalefaces.com to get these this eyeshadow palette um those are also the brushes that I used was by Upscale Faces. Use the code Mika will give you 20% off of her products. So go save the coins. So the products are definitely worth it. If you like it, hit the thumbs up button. If you want to see more videos like this, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload another video. But yeah, until the next video, y'all. Peace.